I gotta be honest. <laughs> I just want to listen to that music over and over and over again. It's just got such a good beat. <laughs> I'm behind that starting screen just going... <laughs> so, welcome! Uh, I'm not going to be doing the Dark Brotherhood uh, quest today like I usually do because there is a... Uh, event. <laughs> There's been a lot of events going on for uh, Elder Scrolls Online. The current one is the Dragonhold Prologue questline. It's uh, the prologue for the next uh, DLC for the new chapter elsewhere that's going to be coming out um, sometime this fall. But, so the prologue quest is supposed to be very linear to the, uh, the story. It's not supposed to, like, spoil anything if you haven't played, the, like, the main quest all the way through. So I think I'm going to do it today. Um, or start it. Start it, at least. Uh, it also says that right now... Let's see. So when you complete the prologue quest, uh, you earn new ways to show your allegiance to the Dragon Guard. Uh, you get a Curio Memento, uh, Dragon Guard banner that you can furnish in front of your home. Uh, you can buy a Horn of Jadar, which we'll find out during this quest line what that is. Uh, there's also something about unlocking bonus gold. So that sounds good. <laughs> uh, there's a zone-wide thing going on right now for Elsewhere, which is where we're at right now. <clears throat> that if we help each other out uh, and defeat those dragons, we'll uh, unlock... My phone is right. I'm just going to ignore it. <laughs> uh, we'll unlock certain in-game events. Or an acquisition, acquisition bo bonus. <laughs> so, we are going to do this. Uh, and I started by going to the crown store. And going over to your quest starters. And getting this letter from Kassura. So I think I do want to try to turn this into something later on. So, uh, per usual, <laughs> usual, I'll just turn that off, uh, and we will see how this goes. But those of us who walk the sands know life's greatest pleasure is strictly sweet. Hey, so I have to go talk to Kazura. Um, I it's also have one sugar that we treasure. <laughs> she was really clashing with the music I was listening to before. <laughs> um, so now that we are a little bit in a quieter spot. Um, I also picked up a daily quest, which uh, we can kind of work on. Well, I don't know if they have dragons in Southern Elsewhere. This might just be a Northern Elsewhere thing, but it's the dragon hunt. Um, I have to go and fight a dragon. Uh, you, they want you to do three of them, all three of them, but it doesn't matter how many of each or in what order. Um, I've already gotten two, so I just need one more. Uh, but we can do that a bit later. Uh, I need to go talk to Kazura. Is that this one? Blade Master Kazura has agreed to search a nearby Dragon Guard tomb for a former student interested in finding ways to fight back against the Dragon of in, uh, in Elsewhere. <laughs> I agreed to help her in this endeavor. <laughs> Kashura, oh my god, I am just having so much trouble today. Kashura requested that I meet her in one of the nearby cities. I should head there now. Devon's Watch. Okay. This is taking longer than I thought. Oh, and I'll stop by the stable on my way to increase my mount speed. Yeah, this is my way. Right there. Let's 
stable. Yeah, we're playing with uh, my favorite avatar of the moment, <laughs> my Templar. see it on the uh the map now but i'm pretty sure it was no that stone falls i need to go up here there we go <clears throat> so i hope in anybody who's watching has been able to check out my new mini series <clears throat> dragon uh Drag dragoon? Dragoon? Dragon? <laughs> My sister was making fun of me because I just was like, how do you say that? <laughs> dragoon? <laughs> dragon. I think it's dragon. <laughs> uh it's Oh, what is that? It's uh well it's dragon. It's not Swedish. Ugh, I, I even wrote it in one of my streams because I was just like, it's not Sweden, you crazy person. It's like... God, I can't even think of the country right now. Sorry for anybody who's watching that. <laughs> All right. Uh, need to go. But anyway, it's a good miniseries. It's, uh... I don't know. To me, it seems pretty obvious what's kind of going on early on. Um, I mean, I'm not completely right. There was definitely a twist there I was not expecting. Um, I don't want to give anything away. <laughs> I mean, you go into it knowing that something is not, is not right. <laughs> um, so, yeah, check it out. Um, I didn't want to do anything too scary for Halloween just because I don't like gory, scary stuff too much. And I was hoping to do something that was a little bit shorter. It's only a four hour game, around four hour game. I'd go upstairs. No? Below, was she? Oh, here we go. I'm at my wit's end. Ah, you received my summons. Hmm, the set of your shoulders, that look in your eyes. Yes, I see I chose well. You will aid me with this most important task. Hmm. This has something to do with the Dragon Guard? Quite correct. A former student requires my assistance but I cannot do what is necessary on my own. Fighting the dragons that plague elsewhere seems an impossible task, but the Dragon Guard once successfully hunted them. We seek their wisdom. <clears throat> and you hope to find this wisdom in a tomb? Tombs. I will search one, you the other, ah. using this Dragon Guard seal. The seal will activate three glyphs, which in turn will reveal the entrance to the tomb. Between the two of us, I pray we find the wisdom my student requires. Will you help me? All right, I'll take the seal and help you. How do I find these glyphs? Find the three glyphs in Othrenus. Let me mark the locations on your map, along with where I think the hidden tomb lies. I prepared notes as well. Feel free to take them with you. 
I just altered the volume of the game a little bit. Um, anybody who watches, let me know if it's too too quiet. Now it looked a little bit loud. Um, how did you become an expert on Dragon Guard? Expert? <laughs> Far from it. I started looking into the history to help my former student. The recent Dragon Guard were defenders of the Emperor. But according to legend, in the distant past, they hunted dragons nearly to extinction. Boy, that sure does sound like the blades. Hmm. Where are the Dragon Guard now? When the last Emperor of the Riemann Dynasty was assassinated, the Dragon Guard were disbanded. Various Emperors in the intervening years have formed their own versions to add legitimacy to their rule, but they were never the same. Hmm. <clears throat> Tell me more about the Dragon Guard seal. It's an heirloom my former student provided. It contains a minor enchantment that reveals hidden glyphs. I imagine it was once used as a way to pass along secret information. Now we will use it to find the hidden Dragon Guard tombs. Who was her former student, I wonder? Oh, <laughs> who is your former student and where are they now? I didn't read. <laughs> we can discuss that later. Right now, we have our own tasks to accomplish. Remember, the dragons are already loose and elsewhere. Just know that my former student seeks a way to fight those great beasts before the damage they inflict cannot be undone. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so there is the seal. Okay, where are Kasiri's notes? Ooh, is that... Did I miss that? Am I supposed to go somewhere? I should read her notes for more information. Are they sitting? Oh, yep. He's pretty popular. <clears throat> Legends of the Dragon Guard can be found throughout Tamriel. They reportedly developed dragon hunting weaponry and weaponry and techniques, and it was by their blades that dragons became almost extinct in our lands. Unfortunately, the Great Dragon Guard Order of Old has long since been disbanded. If I am to gain their wisdom, it must be from histories, documents, and artifacts they left behind. I believe I've discovered two Dragon Guard tombs, close, uh, fairly close together. It was common for soldiers to be buried with their personal possessions, which I hope will provide the cake. Each journal I find, each relic I uncover, provides another tool to aid against the dragons invading elsewhere. Both tombs seem to be protected by a powerful magic which hides entrances from sight. Luckily, my former student was able to find a journal describing Dragon Guard burial practices. It outlined custom, the custom of placing three glyphs near a tomb's entrance, which will, which will activate in the presence of the Dragon Guard seal. These three glyphs should provide the key to the entrance to the tomb. However, both tombs are loca located in perilous, perilous locations. I worry that visiting both will take up far too much time. My abbey and students await me back in Hammerfell. For this task, I will require the aid of another. This helper must locate the northern, southern, and eastern glyph, then use what they find to open the tomb. I almost came across a most curious phrase. I'm certain it's integral to opening the tomb, though I'm unsure how. It is my hope that once the entrance is revealed, the phrase's meaning will also become clear. <laughs> With our blades, honor is sealed. With bravery, the way is revealed. Okay. Once you determine the nature of the three glyphs, you can use that knowledge to reveal the entrance to the tomb. Feel free to consult my notes. They should help if you run into any problems. <clears throat> um, 
I guess I have some questions about what you need. I'll answer what I can, but understand that my knowledge is based mostly on theory and conjecture. We seek hidden glyphs that will help us open Dragon Guard tombs. At least, that is my hope. Hmm. Uh, so, I mean, the, I know the glyphs reveal the hidden door, but I'm going to ask this stuff anyway. What do the glyphs do exactly? A series of glyphs act as a sort of key to the tomb they are connected to. The seal will identify which glyphs to use to reveal the entrance to the tomb. At least, that's what my research indicates. Why do you need my help with this? There are two tombs nearby. While you find a way to enter one, I will attempt to enter the second. This way, we will accomplish twice the work in half the time. Okay, uh, what do you expect to find inside these tombs? Historical documents would be good. The more we can learn about the Dragon Guard and how they hunted, the better chance we'll stand against the dragons. If we're lucky, we may even come upon <clears throat> one of the legendary Dragon Guard weapons. Didn't they tell you something, say something about a dragon burial mound? Um, didn't we expect to find, like, a burial mound then? <laughs> like a, you know, a, a burial mound? <laughs> Uh, maybe I missed something. I don't know. <laughs> All right, let's go find these glyphs. Um, hopefully, hopefully the uh, my is it? audio sounds okay. Uh, I know with my my Skyrim stream, um, my recording anyway, some of the vowels weren't dropping for some reason and I'm not exactly sure why because when I checked it today and I'm using the same settings it sounded fine but I don't know hopefully it sounds okay oh in stone falls really okay I guess maybe Southern Elsewhere isn't open yet. Um, I guess we'll find out. They kind of had us do something like this with uh, the actual Elsewhere prologue quest that came out last year, around this time maybe? Um, okay. Let's head on over there. Understand you were instrumental in crushing the Daggerfall army at Devon's Watch. Yep, that was me. jumpy. <laughs> oh, I like her dress. She's all in the spirit of Halloween. <laughs> yeah, and so the Witches Festival will be coming up in about a couple of weeks, I think. So I'll probably play a bit of that too. I've been here recently. There was a whole uh, part of the Alliance quest. I had to do over here. All right, let's check my usual stuff.
I guess that one's okay. And ooh, 150%. Uh all right. I just I hope I didn't waste that. <laughs> I better make it use uh useful by attacking everything. <laughs> Within reason. Oh. <clears throat> One of the glyphs is blades. One of the glyphs is honor. Bravery. Nope, this must be it. Everybody's here. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, <clears throat> Bravery Blades Honor. And she said something about blades and then something about bravery. would also be loyalty, I think. Unless I'm missing one in the middle. Oh, there's honor. No? Do I have to do it in... <clears throat> okay, let's try it in order on what's actually on my screen. <laughs> I, If that's the case, I kind of wish they'd make it harder. <laughs> Thank you. 
Oh, I must have missed one. Shoot. It is. Right? I'll have to recheck that, but I hate it when they make it too easy. Just do what it says on the screen. No riddle to it. I just, I don't want to rush through it. I want to have like a couple of good shots, you know? <laughs> Probably see one of these being the thumbnail. <laughs> oh yeah, and I forgot that you can do options, video, screenshot mode. So that like everything is actually gone. <laughs> to have. <laughs> it's gonna be like, there's nothing in it. <laughs> hey, talk to Kasira. What did we get? somebody here let's say we honor dragon guard neo behifo protector of our sacred knowledge steward guardian of our sanctuaries may his flame burn eternal huh. I'm not sure that who that is but He has a nice tomb, although it's interesting because there's two other cigar. Uh, oh my gosh. You know, big old coffins. <laughs> I thought you might be up here. It appears you were as successful as I. Did your tomb contain anything of note? Yes, I found a map to a Dragon Guard Sanctuary. Interesting. I found a similar map, but to a different location. This might be exactly what my former student was hoping for. Will you come with me to the Abbey of Blades? To the Abbey of Blades? Uh... Is Sai Sahan your former student? I think that's right. Oh, is Kasura the chick we meet in the main quest line? Who? That that might be the girl, the girl that we meet. Uh, who is involved? Who knows Sai Sahan is and was like the priestess of the Abbey of the Blades or something like that. I can't. I can't, I can't quite remember. It is my home and heart, where I have had the privilege of training many fine blade masters. My most accomplished student will meet us there. We can give him the maps to both sanctuaries and let him decide on the next course of action. Hmm. <clears throat> uh. <laughs> you're, uh, you're not. Yeah, you're being rather secretive about your former students. <laughs> I think it best if my student introduces himself in his own way. Here, you should carry both maps and present them to him yourself. Come, I acquired horses to speed us on our journey. Mm, very well, let's ride to the Abbey of the Blades. We can depart for the Abbey of Blades as soon as you're ready. Hmm, nice uh, armor you got there. I think that's part of the uh, inquest armor. Let's see what else I have. Do I have anything better? For like, uh, costumes in my... Anyway? Hmm. 
Oh, it's this one I was thinking of. But it's different, definitely. No. No. Ah. Maybe. I actually, I want to go with the Gold Saint for this one. Ah, uh, fudge. <laughs> oh, the mounts are right here. All right. The almost inaccessible Valley of the Blades sits deep in the Dragon Tail Mountains of Hammerfell, where Red Guard's devoted to something, something, something. Follow me, warrior. I find the view from this approach most inspiring. Behold, my home and heart, the Abbey of Blades. Hmm. Many blade masters earned their titles on these hallowed grounds. My student waits inside. I think he'll be pleased to receive the maps you carry. Okay. Yeah. This is what I was thinking it was. But, uh, it was much darker the last time. Gee, I wonder what happened. So much destruction. Where is he? <laughs> Hiding out over here. Hey. Slice the hon. Hi. Kasura <laughs> sent word to expect you. Come, let us speak. Oh, I'm so excited to see you. You were like one of my favorite of the five companions. <laughs> How you been? Whoa. <laughs> Greetings, warrior. I am Sai Sahan, former captain of the Imperial Dragon Guard. So you were the captain of the Dragon Guard? Uh, so you know how to hunt dragons? No, but I am trying to learn. The ancient dragon guard were the dragon slayers. My order simply served to protect the emperor. Since the return of the dragons, I have dedicated myself to discovering the old ways of the dragon guard. Hmm. <clears throat> Perhaps these two, these maps will help. They show the location of two dragon guard sanctuaries. Yes, yes. The maps appear to be the right age. The sanctuaries they lead to may well contain the knowledge and relics I seek. We must visit these sites as soon as possible. All right. I just need a little time to study them and determine their orientation. Oh, okay. Well, what do you want me to do in the meantime? Speak to Kasura. She uncovered an ancient dragon guard tool known as a grappling bow. Such a device may prove useful in our journey to come. Why don't you try to figure out how to best utilize it? Yeah, I remember hearing about this. Uh, all right, I'll ask Kisura about the scrappling bow. Uh, but can I ask some questions before I go? Speak quickly, for the sand in the hourglass never stops falling. Hmm. Uh, why do you want to find a way to battle dragon? As far as I know, I'm the last of the dragon guard. Once my duty was to protect the emperor and defend the empire. Now... Now I must carve a new path from the legends of old. Now I prepare to hunt dragons. Hmm. Seems like you're putting a lot of faith in old legend. Someone needs to take up the mantle. Besides, faith and legends go hand in hand. They are the whetstone that sharpens my blade. Hmm. Let us see where my faith in old legends takes us before we dismiss the notion that my predecessors were dragon slayers. Okay. Um, 
Okay. <laughs> I do want to capture that other line uh, discussion path. Find Kasura near the entrance to the training hall. As far as I know, oh, someone needs to Oh, I can't do it anymore? Okay. Well, boy, it sure is nice to see you, buddy. Uh, it's interesting. He doesn't... My This character has not... Uh, has not... Meet done. with me by the stables after you speak with Kasura. Okay. I'll see you later. Bye, Saizahan. Oh, my hero. <laughs> um, my this character hasn't finished the main quest yet, so I wonder if his uh, scripting is different. If uh, if I had, because I haven't actually met him yet, this avatar. I don't know. I kind of think it would probably be the same, but they like to give you little treats that way sometimes. Hey, Kasura. Warrior, did Sai Sahan find the maps as interesting as I expected? Mm-hmm. Yep, he is studying them right now. He suggested I talk to you about the grappling bow. Ah, yes. The grappling bow. A most useful device. Like someone combined a crossbow with a grappling hook. Loose it at a grappling point and the chain retracts to drag you toward it. Oh, that sounds cool. Uh, Sai so said that the ancient dragon guard made use of this device. So we believe. The device requires incredible skill, however. So far, none of my students have mastered it. Oh. Why don't you give it a try? Gather the grappling bow from behind the statue next to the stables. Then return here to begin your training. Okay. Uh, I'll gather the grappling bow and give it a try. I expected you to rise to the challenge. You'll find the grappling bow behind the statue near the stables. Can you tell me more about it? Well, I can certainly tell you what Sai has told me. When the Dragon Guard hunted dragons, they each crafted their own grappling bow. This one was found in a Dragon Guard's grave. What did the Dragon Guard use the grappling bow for? Dragons fly. Dragon Guard do not. Instead, the Dragon Guard utilized the grappling bow to reach higher ground. At least, they did so whenever high points were available. Hmm. Uh, can we use the grappling bow against the elsewhere dragons? I don't think any of us will have time to train to that level. With a little practice, however, it could serve as a means for achieving out-of-reach places. I think that's the best we can hope for in this particular instance. Okay. Yeah, so this is a new uh, activity method. Um, they were saying that if they it picks up people are interested and they like it, they may introduce it to other areas uh, of the game, um, like other countries and such. Right now, I think it's only available... Uh, during this quest line. <laughs> Boy, you guys sure did hide it hard. <laughs> it's another empty box. Ah, okay. It's nice to see this place uh, without utter chaos going on. <laughs> If you guys aren't sure what I'm talking about, follow my main quest uh, series on this on uh, my YouTube and Facebook channels. Ready to train with the grappling bow? Yep, I'm ready. Use the grappling bow to get up to the roof of the training hall and light the brazier you find there. That will demonstrate your innate skill with the device. After that, talk to Sai and see if he's ready to decipher the maps. <clears throat> okay, I'll uh, let the bazaar, uh, briz, brazaar, and then speak to Sai. Start on the ledge of the building behind us. Merely follow the grappling points until you reach the roof of the training hall. Good luck, warrior. And please, try not to injure yourself. Thanks. Oh, cool. <laughs> Oh,
That is a fun way to move around. <laughs> I kind of wish it had more bounce though, instead of just going like in a direct line, it seems like you should kind of like jump up into the air and, uh, you know, do a little bit more of a bounce. Where am I going? Lighting a fire. Oh. I guess it does kind of do a, a little bit of a bounce. Get that one. This old warrior has deciphered the first map. It leads to the Windscour Temple, hidden atop the ruins of Hoonding's Watch. I saw the light of the brazier. I take it you were able to utilize the grappling bow? Mm-hmm. Yep, I uh, used it to reach the roof of the training hall. Excellent. As the saying goes, a weapon is only as reliable as the soldier who wields it. With that being said, it would be best not to drop the device. It's incredibly old. Now, are you ready to depart for Windscour Temple? Uh, I actually want to look around. Um, so I'm going to back out because I don't want to accidentally say yes when I didn't mean to say yes. I'm just wondering if I can get into any of these buildings. Nope, that one is closed off. So is that one. So is that one. Oops. Um. Hey there. Hey there, ho there. Ugh. I kind of doubt there's actually anything worth looking at. I just, I want to double check. Be thorough, you know? Oh, and that's an invisible wall. notice that in some cases when you go around looting butterflies um or butterfly wings the, that rare item i was i've been talking about like i think last stream that after you loot so many of them you'll get like the rare item and then it seems like you they drop the the rare butterfly wings more often um for at least a brief period of time just from the past few times I've been doing this. Oh, 
I wonder if there's like some kind of counter. Like after you reach so many butterflies, uh, looting so many butterflies, it'll drop a loot and then it like increases your chances for a short period of time. I think that's about it. There's like, there's really not el nothing else going on here. <laughs> Ooh, butterfly. Yeah, they just have such a pretty area. Like waterfalls everywhere and... Yeah. All right. Okay, Sai, I'm ready. I'm ready. This old warrior has deciphered the excellent. So what as are we the looking saying goes, for? A weapon is and only as reliable for... as the soldier who wields it. With that being said, it would yeah. be best anything we can use against the dragons. Tomes describing hunting techniques and strategies, weapons. Honestly, whatever appears to be useful. If you spot something of value, let me know. All right, I am ready to depart for Wind Scour Temple. Excuse me, Temple. Let's be on our way then. Gasura has agreed to let us borrow her horses. The sooner we search these Dragon Guard sanctuaries, the sooner we can uncover their secrets. All right. I guess I just jump on the horse. <laughs> Curious. I'll secure the horses while you go on ahead. Thanks, Sai. This is an area that I have not explored with this character yet. Am I going the right way? Yeah, I dropped off my horse and just like, ah, oh, I'll take one of my mounts, thanks. It's haunted over here. What? Mm. Just breathing. 
is still above, so it's probably up there somewhere. He's a Templar too. 8, 10 CP. Nice. up more here we go I found it that is <laughs> all the way up at the top Hidden beneath the ruins of Hu Ding's Watch, this sanctuary hosted the ceremony of ascension for every Dragon Guard Grand Master, starting with the honored Galen Baral. Destined. Oh, hey, Sai. Oh, that reminds me. Uh, need to get my daily reward. I could use some of that fortifying meal earlier. To think that a dragon guard sanctuary was hidden beneath Hoonding's watch all this time. Well, you never know what you're really standing on. Wow. <sighs> it seems this sanctuary won't easily give up its secrets. Come, let us speak. What's up, Sai? It appears the sanctuary's archives are out of reach. There doesn't even appear to be a place to use the grappling bow. I... I don't know how to proceed. Hmm. There must have been a way uh, for the Dragon Guard to reach it. I agree. After all, with the proper application of will, the way always opens. Hmm. Perhaps the answer lies in these statues. Hmm. Do you know anything about these statues? I am familiar with these personages. The statues represent the four greatest Grand Masters the Dragon Guard have ever known. Hmm. Gelen Brawl, who helped establish the Order. Etienne Valiuses, who chronicled their history, and so forth. And how do you know these Grand Masters help us reach that ledge? A brazier stands before each. Perhaps if we were to light them, they would reveal a way forward. Though I also suspect there's a proper order to it all. <laughs> Read each statue's plaque and see if they contain any clues. Are you just guessing? <laughs> All right, I'll read the plaques and try lighting the brazeers. Oh. We honor you, Grand Masters of old. Your flames burn eternal. Uh. Okay. So, Grand Master Eton Volus. First Era, 2879 to 2902. The chronicler of our most sacred pursuit, honored as modest, uh, uh, modest, honest, and astute. She is the last Grand Master that we praise by prayer and faith, Brazier's light. Or for their praise. She is the last Grand Master. Okay, so maybe it's the last one, but it was First Era also, so we'll keep that in mind. Uh, Grand Master Gashu Pier, First Era also, 2734, 2758. He who honored Akatash's light, who fought against the Black Beast light, is the second we praise by fire and prayer as we honor the oath of uh, the Dragon Guard Chair. 
Alright, really? Are they gonna make it that easy also? Alright, so that is the second one. Oh, you're missing your head. Grandmaster Yav Yora for 0208-2035. He who oversaw Alduin's wall. Really? That recorded the dragon's rise and fall. We honor her, the third Grandmaster. Led us through victory and disaster. I think that confirms that they are the Blades. <laughs> if they hadn't really said before, I, I haven't followed the Elsewhere quest line, so maybe they kind of make, they say so also, but <laughs> that is interesting though. She oversaw Alduin's Wall. It's his third Grandmaster. So you are probably the first. Well, not probably, you are. Grandmaster Gilin Brawl, first of the Grandmasters laid to rest, appointed by the Son of the West. We honor him with razor blights. Right. May he watch over our endless light. Okay, let's light this one first. And then we decided this is the second one. And third. Final fourth. Ah. That hit it. Look, a gravel point has appeared on the platform above. Empire knew anything. It was the value of keeping good records. I thought he just spawned up here with us. I was gonna be like, hey, no fair. There's a interesting wall up there too with like people on it. Um too bad I can't go up there. Well, I don't think you can. Yeah, the ladders don't work. Uh climbing ladders does not work. Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> Searching uh, for the Horn of Jadar. Oh, we heard about this earlier, part one. Written by Commander Olin of the Dragon Guard. The Dragon Guard is dying. This is something I cannot deny, no matter how I wish to, it were not so. Yet, I also cannot deny that it was our orders on an epitude that led us down this path. It was we who failed to protect our empire, emperor. We who allowed that vile snake to swallow the empire whole. Disbanded and disgraced, those of us left with the decency of shame have scattered to the winds. And so our pride is broken, and our order is in disarray. But I have learned of an artifact which may become of our salvation, the Horn of Jadar. Legend states that it is the most powerful dragon horn that our order ever created, possessed of a mysterious self-replenishing magic unlike any other dragon horn. With such a relic, I believe we can rally others to our cause and bring honor back to the dragon guard. 
It seems, however, that the Wind Scour does not hold the horn of Jadir, Jadir. And so we travel to Storm Talon next in hopes that we may find the Dragon Horn within that sanctuary's halls. Uh, I found an old, a dusty old book. That's what I found. Have you found anything useful? Dragon hunting techniques, perhaps? Maybe even a weapon? I found a journal. The Dragon Guard came here in search of the Horn of Jadir. The Horn of Jadari? Jadari. This journal claims... It's a dragon horn of great power, and the last of the original dragon guard went in search of it. Incredible. Hmm. I thought dragon horns were merely legends, but according to this, at least one exists. Well, where are they? Why? Why didn't they uh, find it, or you know what, what happened? <laughs> uh, it seems like the sort of relic you were searching for. Indeed. A dragon horn would give us the edge we desperately need to combat the dragon invasion of elsewhere. Mm. Provided this horn is as powerful as the journal indicates. They didn't find the dragon horn here, but they were going to search Storm Talon Temple next. Storm Talon Temple? That's the location revealed by the second map. It's near the entrance to Afrin's Hold in Stormhaven. We should head there at once and see what we can find. All right. Uh... I don't know. I kind of think we're done here. So yeah, let's hun, head on to Storm Talon Temple and uh, I'll be there. Yeah, I might want to do this quest again with one of my other characters so I can get some better footage. Uh, just, you know, boring stuff, walking around, not really and doing the quest, getting more like visual. I don't see Sai Sahan. Well, he'll, he will be along. Are we in Glenumbra? Stormhaven? This music, I just... <laughs> One of my first characters, I was a uh, Daggerfall Covenant. And all over, like the first couple of places you go to, this music is just like playing. It's like, oh, it's a blast from the past. <laughs> A sky shard.
There is always time for looting. Storm Talon Temple. Though the Dragon Guard were mighty soldiers, they also work for competition. The Order would host yearly competitions in Storm Talon Temple, presenting strength and grappling bow competition was said to be particularly fierce. than a sanctuary. Um... I don't know, not... not a maze, per se. Sorry, the, uh... a little bit jumpy there. Flippy. It appears the sanctuary has fallen into ruin, blocking our path to the archives. As the Dragon Guards say, every path is worthy of pursuit, though it seems the path we seek is a rather tricky one. <sighs> Hang on, just one sec. All right, just, uh, just need to stand. All right, so do you have any ideas? Why did you try using your grappling bow? There may be a path forward that we just can't see from this vantage point. Hmm. I suggest you pick a direction and see where it takes you. Cool. If you become stuck, feel free to return here and try again. Okay, I'll try with a grappling hook. So, that one's pretty obvious. Is that pretty much the only way we have to go from here? It appears so. Uh, can't loot everything? Alright. Hey, there's a butterfly up there! Something right there, too. Off, maybe? Ooh. Oh, there's something I missed over here? Oh, it's right ahead of us. <laughs> Look everywhere except right in front of you. Mm Oh, there's one right there. There's one over there. Where am I trying to get? Like right over there. It seems like I want to go this way. Butterfly, you're so close, yet so far away.
Wow, this is making a little, me a little bit dizzy. <laughs> Excellent work. Now see what you can find in the archives. This is an interesting area. I hope that they do bring the grappling hook more into the game. It would be, it'd be fun if they did that. So I keep getting lists of deceased dragons. A list of dragons defeated by the Dragon Guard in the year they were killed. No further information is given. Hmm. I search the... Search the... Curse of the Black Be Black Bees. A Dragon Guard journal written entirely in the uh, cavalry, and a small scribble on the cover translate title. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ah, here we go. Searching for the horn of Jari. Jari? Part two. Written by Commander Olin uh, of the Dragon Guard. After scouring the tombs of Storm Talon, I finally discovered that the horn of Jad. Ariel? That must be a, a typo. Um, it's housed in Dark Water Temple. We should find the entrance to the sanctuary a little way south of Windhelm, in East March. Oh, nice. I also find records that indicate something a bit hard to believe. According to several reports, the dragon horn we see is indestructible, both from physical and magical means. Hmm. I know of no other dragon horn that has such a power. How was the dragon guard able to create this weapon? It also makes me curious as to what matter of dragon the horn of Jadari was carved from. It must have been a truly powerful beast. Was he called Jadari? It seems unlikely, given the distinctly Kashiri sound. Let us hope that when we find the dragon horn, so too shall we uncover its secrets. Interesting since the uh, Elsewhere area is the home of the Kahiti, and that's where the dragons were uh, closed off at. Well, three of them, I think. Maybe there was more. I can't remember now. Hmm. Any luck over there? Yep, I uh, found something. Uh, let me just finish looking at the bookcases. Nice. Oh, I didn't realize that you could continue searching. There. I mean, was that anything I might want to read? Uh, okay.
Am I gonna be able to get back over there? <laughs> Well, it looks like I'm going the right way. They may have done it this way on purpose so they have an easier way to get back over. Hey, Sai. Hey, can I just... No, it wasn't on the post on my side, so I couldn't take that way to try to go back, to go up that way. Just to leave it. Were you able to find the Horn of Jadari? Uh, no, but I found another journal. It says that the Dragon Horn resides in Darkwater Temple. Interesting. We should prepare to face further challenges. Neither Windscour nor Storm Talon were easy to navigate. I suspect this next sanctuary will prove similarly difficult. Does the book indicate where this dark water is located? It's uh, the sanctuary in East March, south of Windhelm. We can take the horses to Windhelm and then search on foot from there. All right. Yep. Let's head to Darkwater Temple. There was a name like that in the game of Skyrim. I wonder if it's the same thing. Uh, which brings to mind that area was infested by Thalmar. Thalmor. And... You know, I don't know that Elder Scrolls Online has uh, had shown any enemies that are Thelmore. I think so. Hmm. One of the old holds. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> they should have been back by now. Captain Alhana said they'd meet us That's here she said, after an but evening I don't of see prayer, them. right? Kinds grow. The traveling merchant said is true. Kinds Grove. Kinds Grove. What? I I got to admit I haven't done much exploring in Windhelm, in Elder Scrolls Online because I just haven't had an opportunity to. Ah. Uh, and I don't want to go too far off track when it's an alliance area that your own alliance, you know, will have you explore a bit of. Pines Grove is the place where you go in Skyrim. Kissed Thrall. Interesting. Yay, butterfly wing. Darkwater Temple. The cold halls of Darkwater Temple, now silent and housed the guard as they trained in the art of dragon slaying. The sanctuary was quickly abandoned. Oh, 
Oh, that is just pretty. All of those bug, uh, I don't know what those are. Berries? Something or other. Makes it look like the night sky, almost. What happens if I fall down? Is there a way to get back up? I'm sure there has to be. Romano! Oh. What? <laughs> Watch your step. <laughs> That's okay. Nothing's broken yet, but I'll have to keep an eye on that stuff. All right. Now we know. And we don't have to go to sleep tonight wondering what if. Man, this place is a mess. So, was I supposed to wait for Sai Sahan? Oh, he's down there. Okay. Wow, look at that. Like an invisible bridge. <laughs> it's like Indiana Jones and what the one of the one of the movies. <laughs> I don't see a way farther into the sanctuary. Perhaps you'll have better luck. Uh, I don't think you noticed the, uh, invisible brick. I noticed something. Yeah, look at that. Oh. <laughs> uh, that shouldn't show up if you don't have the dust or whatever. So, if I try to walk on it now, I'll probably fall, right? And die. Uh, you know, I would do it, but I don't want something to break. So, uh, I'm just going to, uh, look around. <laughs> no, that doesn't seem helpful. Whoa, 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 the horror of Castle Exiri, part one. Oh, it's a book. I'll go through slow. You can read it. Hope that wasn't too fast. You should try looking somewhere else. Dude. I'm on your side here. Nothing useful yet? Man, you're not useful at all. Ah, there's three butterflies right up there. <laughs> The path leading farther into this sanctuary is hidden from us. I see neither grappling points nor braziers to light. There must be another way.
All right, I'm gonna try it. <laughs> where did they get the, uh, where do you get that? Ugh. I am oh shoot. I don't want to miss something. So let's let's go back and see if we can figure out where they're getting that from. See, that is one reason I don't like it when they have all these players in the same area. I wish it was like a solo dungeon because that totally gave away like what what exactly I'm looking for. Oh. Was... Maybe I just missed this? Ah. Mariel... Uh, Mary... Mary... Mary Lynn? Mary Lan? I know you're nervous about leading the initiatives tomorrow, but there's nothing to it. Just do your best to encourage them to honor those who came before and to be the best dragon guard they can be. If you did want to test their wits, however, I came up with a riddle for how to get across the chasm. You can even make it into a competition. Whoever solves it first can have the privilege of shining both our boots. After all, what's the point of moving up the ladder if we can't reap some benefits? <laughs> Take the dust of our fallen bow and offer it to the altar. As you walk the path of the dragon guard, you may May your steps never falter. Eland Belbus. A travel for you. There's an urn beside it. Why don't you see what it contains? Oh, up there. Out of all of the urns, it's supposed to be this one. That's dragon bone powder. The ancient dragon guard used it in their ceremonies. Butterfly. Yeah, see? I like, I got a butterfly wing recently and then i got another one just now and then i got another one uh now it's up there of course the powder reveals a hidden path follow it quickly 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 So I'm trying, I don't want to fall off. <laughs> I know from that last time, it just slightly off and uh, it will fall. Another archive, no dragon horn in sight. Let's look around. I'm good on fishing bait, that's for sure. Oh, that was 
that's fast. Searching for the Horn of Gajari. Part three. I am sure I'm still saying that wrong. Uh, written by the Commander Olin of the Dragon Guard. My travels and research have led me to the Sanctuary with the hope that I would find the Horn of Jadari within. Alas, it seems that while the great dragon horn once rested within these walls, it has long since been stolen away. And by the few accounts I have discovered, I believe that the theft was performed by none other than a dragon. Hmm. While it pains me to learn of such a grave dishonor to our order, I am resolved, more resolved than ever to get it back what is rightfully ours. I have surmised that we'll find this foul creature in a dormant volcano located in southern elsewhere. There we go. I have also learned its name. Bell Ba Lo Loxen. Ba Loxen. Loxen, I think. <laughs> the man uh, the map included herein shows the way to its lair. If we find this beast, we will find the dragon horn. I can think of no greater pleasure than slaying such an enemy. It's time it's time for myself and my fellow soldiers to to finally prove the might of the Dragon Guard. After all, what better way to return our glory than with a dragon hunt? Though we are small in number, we are brave of heart. We are Dragon Guard. We will face this dragon or die in the attempt as our order always has. Okay, there has got to be, like, a Dragon Guard song. You know how, like, the Dragonborn has a song and uh, other things have, <laughs> have a song. It just sounds uh, very uh, lyrical. <laughs> Though we are small in number, we are brave of heart. We are Dragon Guard. We are Dragon Guard. All right. <laughs> have you found something? Yes. I found it. Did you find anything? Oh, well, not Something the about the dragon horn. I found another journal. It says a dragon named Vak Valokazen stole the dragon horn. By Leki's blade. Of all the possibilities I imagined, that was never among them. No matter the dangers, we must retrieve that dragon horn. The fate of elsewhere depends on it. Did the journal indicate where Valokazen lairs? Uh, the dragon makes its lair in a dormant volcano in southern elsewhere. The journal includes a map. Such a journey requires planning and preparation. Let's return to the Abbey of Blades and check in with Nosora. All right, sounds good. Uh, I would like to explore the sanctuary a bit These more, dragon though. Dragon Guard sanctuaries, hidden for so long. How many more lie buried in the dust? How much knowledge remains lost to us? Uh, I don't know. Maybe we will... Well, we will probably never know the extent of it. <laughs> wow, I'm just picking up all sorts of good stuff. Of course, it helps. I don't really... <laughs> I don't uh, really do crafting with this character, so... Um... Every time you, like, read a book about something, you gain that skill line. <laughs> and then I'll gain a level, and I won't... I actually have the infinite. Are we all the way back at the beginning? No. If for some reason I wanted to go back over that way, I could. Although you could just jump in the water. Hmm. Come here, are you out of range? I don't think so. Ah, 
fine. Whatever. All right, all right. Let's go. These dragon guns. All right, <clears throat> I'm gonna take a quick break and then we will be back at it. So I'll be right back.
All right. I am back and ready to wrap this quest up. I kind of think we're wrapping it up anyway. Um, I was kind of thinking maybe, you know, it's a little bit longer, but it seems like every time I think that, it's like, oh, this is actually the end of the quest. <laughs> uh, so, Kazuri, what's up? The warrior returns. Yep. Was your search of the Dragon Guard Sanctuary successful? Oh, yeah, I guess what's up with me? <laughs> we learned of a Dragon Guard weapon called the Horn of Jadari. It's a powerful dragon horn. Dragon horn? Hmm? Huh? I have heard of such relics in stories and legends. Well, this one has unique powers, but it was stolen by a dragon. Stolen by a dragon? Well, Sai Sahan has always enjoyed a good challenge. Hmm. How will you find this creature? Uh, a journal contained a map to its lair. It's li it lies in southern elsewhere. A long way to go. But such a relic is what Sai was hoping to find when he set forth upon this path. May Lecky watch over you, warrior. You and Sai both. Oh, thank you, Kasuri. I assume you told Kasura of our adventure, warrior. Yes. When you brought the Dragon Guard Sanctuary maps to me, I had no idea what we would find. Hunting techniques, perhaps. Maybe a weapon or two. But the promise of a dragon horn. That's more than I dreamed possible after all this time. Uh. Well, I'm not really sure, even sure what a dragon horn does, uh, but we don't have the dragon horn yet, either. Those who risk nothing inadvertently risk it all. Either we face this single dragon to gain a dragon horn, or we face a horde without such a weapon at our side. Hmm. But what's risk without reward? Here's something for the aid you provided thus far. Mm, thank you. The journals we discovered in the Dragon Guard Sanctuaries point to one obvious conclusion. The Horn of Jadari exists, but was stolen by the dragon Valoxen. Mm. You must enter the dragon's lair in Southern Elsewhere and retrieve the horn. What happened? That happened so long ago. Can we be sure the dragon horn still exists? The journals indicated that the horn was indestructible. And stand our nose that dragons are as close to immortal and unchanging as the earth and sky. Fate has placed the Horn of Jadari in our path for a purpose. I believe that with all my heart. Hmm. Were you able to determine the location of the Dragon Slayer? Despite its age, the map included with the journal clearly shows where we must go. A dormant volcano in southern elsewhere. Hmm. I ask you, friend. Will you make this journey with me? Of course. Of course I'll accompany you to the Dragon's Lair. Bye. The horses will carry us to the nearest port. From there, we can charter a boat and sail to southern elsewhere. Thanks to the map you found in Darkwater Temple, it should be easy enough to find Voloxen's lair. Hmm. Before we depart, can we review what we learned at the Dragon Guard Sanctuaries? An excellent idea. Wisdom and reason are sharpened into focus every time we scrutinize the things we learned. What would you like to discuss? So, what's the significance of the Horn of Jadari? When Emperor Varin made me captain of his Dragon Guard, I swore to protect the Empire. With the return of the dragons, I knew I had to find a way to fight the beasts, just like the Dragon Guard of old. The hmm. Horn of Jadari could be our best weapon. So, the horn is a weapon. It's a dragon horn of great power, nearly indestructible and able to replenish its innate magic. It has no equal. With the horn of Jadari, we have a chance to defeat the dragons of elsewhere. Without it, the dragons have a distinct advantage. Hmm. And then, what do we know about the Lokizen's, the Lokizen's lair? The journal described a dormant volcano near the coast of Southern Elsewhere, though I suspect we'll find a cave or ruin nearby. Dragons prefer secure layers and aren't known to nest out in the open. Plus, it needs a place to hide the stolen horn. Hmm. Hmm. How do you think uh, he managed to steal the dragon horn? I never heard of Oloxen before we saw the name in the journal. The dragons are clever creatures. 
Besides, the Dragon Guard was dissolved around that time. In all likelihood, the Sanctuary was abandoned, leaving the Horn of Jadari undefended. Hmm. Do you think we are truly prepared to face the dragon? What an unusual question. Don't you know that great deeds set the stage for greater victories? And what a deed you already accomplished, facing down a mighty dragon. Yes, I defeated a dragon in Northern Elsewhere. Rumor has it that all of Anequina knows you to be a mighty dragon hunter. <laughs> really? Honestly, I find it invaluable to fight alongside someone with your expertise. Wow, thanks. Lokesen should prove little trouble for you and I. Uh, I think you are the better fighter than me, but thank you. <laughs> uh, I don't think we should take this dragon's threat that lightly. Regardless of the risks we face, we have a duty to Tamriel to retrieve this dragon horn. As a blade master and captain of the Dragon Guard, I am quite up to the task of helping you take down this dragon. Hmm. All right. Well, you've convinced me. I am ready to depart. So, those ruins are cursed, I tell you. Some fools tried to turn it into a Kwama mine, and most of them died. Now it's haunted or something. A ghost, a beast, something. Sure, you can enter, just don't expect to leave. Huh. Kanoraka, uh, merchant, I believe. And I leveled up. Oh! Uh, let's see, do I want a dog or a cat? Dog or a cat. Dog or a cat. I just chose this of my other character, too. Um, I would like to get a cat, but to be honest, it's a little weird to have a cat. Well, I can leave it at the house, but then it doesn't really move. It just kind of sits in one area. A dog, you would find expecting to run around with their master, you know? I'll do that, I guess. Alrighty. The dragon's lair should be nearby. Be on your guard, warrior. Uh, haven't we been here before? This looks really familiar. That Kashiti ruin in the distance. Fine place for a dragon to nest. It looks kind of like a couple of spots I've been before, but it's not the same thing. Is that Sai? Or is that an oh, that must have been another play. Uh, okay. That was pretty quick. Curious. It seems this place once served as a Kwama mine, though it appears abandoned now. warrior.
hide in the shadows, beast. Come fight us in the light! You sound just like the Dragon Guard who last graced these halls. <laughs> I was gonna say a while ago that it was pretty safe to assume that the dragon guard who left the journals uh died here <laughs> oh although interesting he left his journal well i guess maybe he was trying to leave a uh message to any dragon guard that followed oh uh, yep maybe this is him The dragon guard who sought the horde of Jadari in ages past. May your light burn eternal, old warrior. Did I pick something up there? Hmm. And it looks like the other, like the books and things that I picked up at. The other location just kind of disappeared. You see the horn of my cowardly brother. Pathetic. Like the dragon guard before you, death will be your only reward. The horn of Jadari? Is that the horn of Aloxan's brother? Hmm. Oh, I forgot that I had a bow and arrow. Grandmaster Vashu if it's dragon guard found only death and Baloxin's lair. Letter. Stay alert. I fear the beast lays a trap for us. Letter to Halakaku. When you when you convinced me to buy this moon's curse Kawama mine, <laughs> Meliana uh, had no idea that it was overrun with these creatures. How are we to collect eggs when those horrible warriors patrol every hall? And this place is like a maze, so big. Why were we even not even given a map? This one knew we shouldn't have never trusted your braggart of an uncle. He's played us both for fools. Getting this mess of a mine off his paws and making a tidy profit as well. Melina wants you to find another buyer quickly before the world starts spreading rumors. Try to find someone foolish enough to take this cursed Kwama mine off our hands. Until then, we must abandon this foul place and hope the creatures can fend for themselves. Hey, Leila. Hmm. Well, it's amazing the dragon didn't eat them.
There he is. Well, survive the swarm. The dragon's roar has stirred the quiver. Defend yourself. My phone's alarm started going off in the middle of that. <laughs> Uses Kwama as a form of defense. How cowardly. Where did he go? Hmm. Wonder what was here before. What kind of temple it was who who it was for like usually it's you know to a god or something in chaos oh it's just informational step quickly we don't want to be caught in the open oh i think we're fine <laughs> and then the dragon appears <laughs> Drawbridge blocks our way. See if you can find any clue as to how to operate the pulleys. There's a bird on this one. Uh, a lion? Lion head? Uh, hourglass? Uh, another bird. Uh, another lion head. And the hourglass. So, oh, what's that? I see you, Arrow. Search for clues. Can I? Oh, there we go. Sergeant Baraya. The dragon refuses to confront us directly, but it roars and sends hordes of Kwama to attack. We were overwhelmed by the sheer number of the creatures. Of the four of us who came back, came to retrieve the horn of Jadari, only I remain. There are only four of you? I guess there's only two of us right now. A drawbridge blocks my path forward. I know that the pulleys must somehow be connected to the bridge, but it's hard to concentrate after losing so much blood. I can hear the Kwama scratching along the walls and the dragon flies nearby. It taunts me, assured of its own victory. It keeps repeating a phrase over and over. One thief flies overhead. Alka Tash stands, stands in glory. The mane blows before their greatness. Really? Really? The dragon is telling you what... It relates to the pulleys, I know, but by the divines, I don't know how. As my blood pools and my eyesight fades, I realize that all we did to did accomplish 
nothing. And I can't even face the beast who mocks me. All I can say is a prayer for my fallen companions and for me, Sergeant Bride. So... So it's the bird, the hourglass, the lion. Why would he be giving away <laughs> the bird, the hourglass, Ah, oh, boy. Notice the pulleys? They should help us lower the drawbridge. Unfortunately, I'm not sure which combination of settings will open the way. Uh, See if you can find anything that could assist us. Uh, a dragon tar tried to lower the drawbridge. She left a note behind which contains a riddle. It's not really. Okay, yeah, a riddle. Try to lower the drawbridge, you say? Well, that certainly doesn't bode well for us. Tell me the riddle. Kintharki flies overhead. Alkatash Alkash stands in glory. The main bow bows before their greatness. Hmm. Kinarthi is the Kajiti god of travel. Not unlike Tava, the bird god. Alkash is called Akatash by most, the dragon god of time. And the main is a Gajiti spiritual leader. Don't say. <laughs> what do they have to do with the pulleys? Each pulley features an icon. A bird, an hourglass, or a Khajiit. This riddle must hint toward where to position the two pulleys of each icon. Remember, Kanarthi flies <laughs> overhead. Alkosh stands yep, in Yep, yep, yep. All right, I, I have to have that. <laughs> Notice the pulleys? They should help us lower... Try to... Hmm. Each pulley features an icon. I need to have that if bird, I want to make a hourglass video a about Khajiit. it in the future. This riddle must hint toward where to position the two pulleys of each icon. Remember, Kanarthi flies overhead. Alkosh stands in glory. The main bows before their greatness. All right. I'm assuming we just do it in order. Um, if it's any more difficult than that, then I'm I, I bow to the wisdom of the people, developers of Elder Scrolls Online, for actually coming up with a challenging uh, puzzle. <laughs> Although that's not entirely fair. The moon puzzle from Elder Scroll from the uh, Elsewhere chapter. The prologue uh, was kind of difficult at first. Well, that didn't work, so maybe I didn't do that right then. Kantharthi flies above. Alkash stands ready or whatever. The main. What am I missing here? Notice the pulleys? They should help us lower the drawbridge. Unfortunately, I'm not sure which. Try to lower the drawbridge, you say? Hmm. Kinarthi is the Kashi. Each pulley features an icon, a bird, an hourglass, or a Khajiit. This riddle must hint toward where to position the two pulleys of oh. each icon. Oh. So the bird needs to be above. The hourglass should, I guess, just be where it was. Maybe in the middle? 
Notice the pulley. Try to lower the main the bows before they're great now. So it's that means to bend down. So I guess I didn't realize that you had uh, more than one position here. Just ahead. That was a little bit trickier. Stumped me for a moment. I bow to the developers. And this. <gasps> there it is. Woo. Where's the dragon? At last, the Horn of Jadari. Now we finally have a chance against this dragon threat. Here, Sai, you should take the dragon horn. We have reclaimed the Horn of Jadari! The dragon's the horn could Two be arms. given. Pity I don't share my brother's sentiment. me like a rag So, yeah, when he shouts like that, <laughs> he's calling to the Quarmy. All right, I'm ready. A dragon's horn willingly given. Pity I don't share my brother's sentiment. of his life off. So he should just keep on pumping that horn. <laughs>
wow. And he's like throwing fireballs and stuff too. Ugh. Ah, jeez. We need to, like, take this guy down. No! I'm such a low level, so level hit points right now. No! Ugh. like dead. Come on. Use your horn. That was kind of difficult. <laughs> I'm really glad that I didn't die more than once, though. I was on the edge of death multiple times. <laughs> However. Uh, why can I not loot you? Oh, there we go. moment, if you please. Our battle against the Loxen left me quite exhausted. Return to the Abbey of Blades and let Pesura know when we succeeded. I will follow as soon as I can. Aw. You did great. Although you could have used that horn a little bit more often. Yeah, this is kind of what they did for the uh, the prologue quest for Elsewhere. They uh, they didn't they had this like standalone dungeon uh, because the Elsewhere chapter had not actually been released yet, and uh, the Southern Elsewhere part has not yet been released. So. the horses how are they going to get through this uh overgrown area <laughs> uh travel by wet like uh, by magic it's a, a magic wagon <laughs> i guess so
We're back. I don't know why it defaulted to the next quest. Hey, Kishuri. It is good to see you hale and whole, warrior. But where is Sai? Did something happen? Mm, Sai is fine. He, we defeated Val, Valok and retrieved the horn of Jadari. Found the dragon horn. Yep. I like his perfectly. That is. Good news. Thank you, warrior. Mm -hmm. You did far more than help Saizahan recover the wisdom of the Dragon Guard. Because of your efforts, he finally has a way to combat this dragon invasion. Oh, that's great. Uh, yeah, it kicks some butt. <laughs> Sai should be along shortly. Oh. I have returned, and I bring the dragon horn. Come, let us speak. Now that we have the Horn of Jadari, our true work begins. As the saying goes, strike when the opportunity appears, or stand by and do nothing. I can never do nothing. And the Horn of J Jadari is an opportunity? Most certainly. <clears throat> you saw how it knocked Veloxen out of the sky. Oh yeah. Granting us a significant advantage in battle. If it's as indestructible as the journal says, it will prove invaluable in the battles to come. I just wish we knew the horn's origin. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, does the origin of the dragon... Oh, wow. What a bad opportunity... Bad time to yawn. <laughs> uh, so I think it does matter, but does the origin of the dragon horn matter? Veloxen implied that the dragon horn was willingly given by another of its kind. What manner of dragon would give away its own horn? And for what purpose? Well, perhaps things will become clearer with more study. Hmm. And what's your next move, Sai? I must train with the dragon horn and prepare for what lies ahead. And so must you, warrior. When the time comes, I will call for your aid. Together, we shall fight back against the dragons drive them from elsewhere this i swear to you all right when the dragon guard dies we say a prayer may your flame burn eternal it's a promise to honor them a desire for their legacy to live on and it's an oath that we uphold to never forget those who came before hmm. an oath i will always honor uh, after you train with the dragon horn, what happens next? Reports tell me that the dragons have moved into southern elsewhere, ravaging towns and villages along the way. That is where I will go. And I'll send for you when I get there. Just the two of us? Will that be enough to turn the tide of the dragon? We won't be alone. We'll rally others to our cause. Those willing to take up the mantle of the dragon hunters of old. It will be glorious. <laughs> we still have so much to learn, though. So much to do to reignite the Dragon Guard. All right. Fantastic. Let's check out our mom the memento uh, that we got. We got other things, too. Uh, let's see. So that's my dog, right? Dragon Horn Curio. Crafted with great care, this Dragon Horn replica represents your past triumph with Sai Sahan against Va Loxen. Simply blow and a wave of, of a wave em emanates from it. It does not, however, affect dragons. <laughs> uh completed for that quest I just did. Okay. <laughs> ah! Oh, can I do that again? <laughs> That's fantastic. 
<laughs> I love it. <laughs> All right. Uh. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I am over <laughs> over my time. <laughs> um, but that was fun. It's good to uh have done the prologue so that when they do uh release Southern Elsewhere, which should be able to do without spoiling any of the quest events or quests for the main quest or whatever. Um, because I would like to check it out. Um, oh, did my screen freeze? Well, there I am, frozen in time. <laughs> anyway, we're. I'm just going to go ahead and end it here uh, since I'm over my time. And um, I'll be back on next week for the Dark Brotherhood or Elder Scrolls events or whatever. Um, I might go log on early next week, actually. So uh, follow me on Just Push to Play on Twitter, um, on YouTube, on Facebook. I will update it as I find out what I'm going to do. <laughs> Until then, I will see you guys next week.